wretches of the underworld, take heed. This is where you belong. You feel out of place? Where would you even go? What would you have me do? Your place is here. My place is with my mother. Hello there, Dionysus. As soon as you get up to Olympus, man, it's gonna be a feast like you have never seen. You mark my words. Now take this, and good luck. Cheers, mate. distance from the surface you just keep at it like that and with our help we'll have you out of there for sure Poseidon's strength my keepsake from chaos will protect me Mountain chamber. Too bad I can't bottle this stuff. Watch him out already, hmm? My boastful brother gets on with Lord Hades even worse than I. So let me put a little spark into his storms for you. All right, Lord Zeus. Okay. 
curse of chaos has been lifted. Daedalus power. what lurks in the river sticks. Spend it all in one place, mate. Delicious. You're just testing me here, right, Charon? I mean, when you place a huge sum of coin conspicuously within my reach, what do you expect me to do? <laughs> Sounds good, mate. When I rob you from now on, it's just my way of saying, Charon, I would like to battle you to the death right now for a quick change of pace. I'd settle this like gentlemen, Charon. <laughs>
Ugh, Charon, I am going to pay you back. Ah, I, um, hello? You had it out with Charon again, huh? And it turned out like it did before. The thing you have to understand is he's got lots of upper body strength. You seen the definition in his arms? Maybe try some rowing for yourself. You try it. How fair your labors, lad? You have a certain look about you. Everything all right? It's just, within Elysium, I happened on a shade who said he knew you, said he misses you. Do you know a Patroclus, sir? What? I... Yes. I knew Patroclus. Did he... Is he all right? He... I don't know. He seemed like he's known better times than these. Is there something I should say to him if I run into him again? Please send him my regards. And all my love. I think of him always. But I cannot see him any longer. And you mustn't ask me why, do you understand? Now, leave me be, please, lad. I need some time. I... take care then, sir. What's the good word? Oh. You want more pets? I got more pets here, boy. Cerberus merely feigns concern for you. The watchdog Cerberus observes the prince. See you, boy. It is woefully infrequent that I've cause for this, but I do have to thank you, boy. You've culled the satyrs and the vermin bringing ruin to our temple there. Blasted creatures multiply at an alarming rate. They're not doing your bidding, yet they're every bit as bothersome as all your wretched servants I've met. I'm surprised you aren't getting along. They are a plague upon this realm, although we have them well contained for now. And once they are rightly dead, they tend to swear to me their fealty. Pushovers. Say, Orpheus, Eurydice told me your songs. Some of them came from her. She seems quite brilliant. You choose your muse as well. I owe my everything to my Eurydice. She authored many of my songs indeed, and she inspired many, many more. Whilst living, we collaborated frequently, you see. But weren't you the famous one? I don't understand why she doesn't share your renown. It is but one of life's injustices, I fear. I always sang her praises every chance I had, and she asserted herself splendidly. Yet even still, our listeners believed our songs, they came from me. What else could I have done? I don't exactly know the ways of mortals, mate, but I'm pleased to hear you always giving credit where it's due. I know no other way, my friend. Your kindness toward me is unnecessary, child. You know I have no expectation of such gifts from you or anyone. I think of you always, Nyx. You raised me as your own, and I am grateful for it. Chaos seems to have taken somewhat of a liking to me, Nyx. They mentioned you. They mentioned me, did they? I thought, perhaps, that they had long forgotten. You should know they are my mother and my father, child. We have not spoken since the dawn of time. That's... oh. You, your Highness! Oh, <laughs> thanks for talking to me, Prince. I have to go. Cooking's one way to pass the time. Totally worth it. What's in stock? do that yet. All set. You were bound. 
important to me. Hey, boyo. You know, pal, when you're not around and it's just me and all your weapons, I mean your infernal arms right over there. Between us, they are making me a bit uncomfortable. Can't blame you, mate. I wouldn't want to be stuck in a chamber with a bunch of legendary, quite possibly malevolent killing artifacts. Anything I can do? Oh, I didn't mean it like a bad thing, boyo. The weirder you make those things, the more it gives me the shakes and keeps me hopping like this nice and steady till the next time you get back. So thanks. Uh, sure. Here's the fee. A bit more mood lighting in the main hall is certainly in order, isn't it? The light of Ixion is bright enough. Too pricey for me. Denied. Just need to keep at it.